2013 is drawing to a close, but before you focus on new resolutions, you may want to complete one more project this year. If you make your home more energy efficient before December 31st, that's tomorrow, you could be eligible for a federal tax credit. In today's Angie's List report, while you may want to start with a home energy audit. For homeowner Steve Chase, a home energy audit gave him peace of mind by proving recent home improvements were not wasted. We didn't build the house. We bought the house existing. Uh, it had been five years old when we moved in. And so I think the biggest prize for us was just pleasantly that we didn't have any big issues. And many of the small issues we had, we were able to fix without much trouble. There are several products and appliances that may qualify for a tax credit, including insulation, heating and cooling equipment, roofing and windows. But before you commit to any improvements, evaluate your home's needs. An energy audit can help do that by telling you how much energy your home uses and what you can do to improve efficiency. Well, I have my infrared camera right here, and what we do is uh, we go through the house, we look at everything, floors, doors, windows, ceilings, uh, everything that we can think of, and we're trying to find issues within the house. Auditors also conduct a blower door test to detect leaks. This is the... Uh, the skin of the blower door and I pre-assembled it but it goes right into the uh, into the door like this. An audit typically takes about three to four hours to complete and costs two hundred fifty to eight hundred dollars. Most auditors take pictures both infrared and digital and include those in a report with descriptions and suggestions on how to fix issues. When hiring an energy auditor the thing you want to make sure is that they're actually an independent third party. The auditor should come in and give you an assessment. They shouldn't be selling you the actual items. And you should always be home at the time of the audit so you can walk through your house room by room with the auditor. For a list of products and appliances that may qualify for a tax credit, head to the Angie's List website. Keep in mind that the total credit cannot exceed $500, and it must be claimed on the 2013 Federal Income Tax Form. You'll need to fill out IRS Form 5695 and provide a copy of the manufacturer's certification statement along with the receipt. Your service provider should be able to help you with the certification statement. I'll post all this information up on our website, WTXL.TV. Just look under the Getting It Done with Abby section.